This is a cool one combining handstands, forearm stands and handstand push-ups. Now to get the eccentric, the down, you actually don't need a handstand push-up. I've had some people that get this and they didn't have a handstand push-up, so in some ways it's a little bit easier than the handstand push-up. So for, first of all, we need to have a couple of things. We need to have a, a forearm stand, a handstand, and then all we're gonna do is combine the handstand and the forearm stand. So I'm gonna place one arm down on the floor. I'm having weight in the elbow, weight in the hand. And then I'm making a triangle with the other hand. So we'll go somewhere in the middle. You wanna be using all three points. So then it's easier to balance. Play around with that position in. Once you've got that, you can make it cleaner by having the legs together. And then this is the down movement that I don't think is actually too hard once you've got a little bit control in both the handstand and in the forearm stand. So as I rotate down and bring the elbow towards the floor, keep weight in the hands and obviously take weight into the elbow and the hand at the bottom to make that triangle nice and strong again. Now you could do those positions, the handstand, the forearm stand and the eccentric with light toe assist on the wall. And then if you want to do the full movement, so the down and the back up, you obviously do need a handstand push up. So same thing, come down, control at the bottom, come back to the bottom of the handstand push up and then back up as one. Let me know if you have any questions and I'll speak to you next time. Thanks guys.